With equations in one variable, one of the first things that we were interested in doing was solving such an equation. That is, finding out what the solution was. As we saw in the last video, equations in two variables typically have lots of solutions. And by a solution, we mean just what we've always meant by a solution. We mean values of the variables that make the equation true. Notice, when we have an equation in two variables, a solution consists of two numbers, one for each variable. For example, in the equation 2a plus 3b equals 12, one solution is a equals 3b equals 2. That consists of two values, but it's just one solution. If I plug in a equals 3, b equals 2, the equation is true. Okay, but how do we go about finding a solution to an equation in two variables? Well, we have to find a pair of numbers that together make the equation true. The simplest method for finding a solution is, well, we pick one of the numbers. I can pick a equals 9. Where did I get 9? I made it up. You could pick any number you wanted for a. Or instead of picking a number for a, you could also pick a number for b you would get a different solution than the one I'm about to get, but you would also get a solution to this equation. So when we plug that in, we get 2 times a is 9 plus 3b equals 12. And looking at this, you should notice we now have an equation in one variable. All we need to do is solve it. So we have 18 plus 3b is 12. We subtract 18 on both sides. 3b is negative 6. Divide both sides by 3, and we get b is negative 2. OK, so what does that give us? That gives us a pair of values, the one that we picked and the one that we found, that is a solution to the equation. So in our example above, the pair a equals 9 and b equals negative 2 is a solution to the equation 2a plus 3b equals 12. And that really is true, right? 2 times 9 plus 3 times negative 2. That's 18 plus negative 6, which really is 12. That's always going to be how we go about finding a solution to an equation in two variables. We pick a value for one of the variables, plug it in. Now we have an equation in one variable that we saw. 